great. The contest just started. Did you post the photo? I did, and it's admittedly the best photo of me ever taken. Um, I'm a little nervous as to where all those likes are going to come from. I need you to not talk about that and jinx me, okay? I've got hundreds more followers than I did when this whole thing started, and that diet tea controversy really put me on the map. Well, I was thinking that once the contest is over, you know, however it ends up, I do want to start thinking about how to plan to move your career forward. Okay. You know, like maybe we could answer some of these emails. Sure. Okay. So the first is a casting call. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a show for Freeform. The role is a blind, deaf, teenage hunk, bisexual vampire zombie that gets adopted by a family of Jesuits. Okay, that's ridiculous. Jesuit. You know, I don't want to do any casting calls, because odds are I will get cast, and then that sounds like a lot of work. Are you sure? This is a real acting gig. It would be the perfect level of exposure. Have you ever done anything like that before? Don't even get me started on exposure, okay? I've had a real acting job before, where I had to get whipped, tased, and dragged through the mud naked. Oh my god, Rafe, that sounds awful. Do you have the link still? That's the worst part. I never even got my copy. That's what I get for taking Brian Singer's acting boot camp. Okay, um, so a note of that one. Wait, Mark, what are you doing here? We're having our production meeting. We are having our production meeting. You're supposed to be filming it. What happened at the beginning of this when we were supposed to be equals? We are equals, okay, Mark? We just have different roles. Shana and I are the creative leads. Shane has got logistics. I'm a star. Shane has got experience. I have talent. And you own a camera. I don't know why I have to keep explaining this to you. Okay, so it's a no to the casting call. Uh, the next email is from Sarah. Barella? No, your high school friend, Sarah Dolores. So she's arriving at LAX tomorrow for LuxCon and wondered if you could pick her up from the airport. Oh. Okay, so this is why we don't lie. I didn't lie. You told her you were already a famous influencer. You said you had like millions of followers. You also said you would win this photo contest. I could still win. It's not over yet. Okay, I'm telling her to take a car service. Meanwhile, you need to focus on the next two hours and 42 minutes, all right? How are we gonna get you more likes? Is there another way to get a VIP spot at the convention? Maybe we just buy a pass and make it look like you already won. Yeah, like maybe there's another way. I know I have some contacts at the convention center. LuxCon's not at the convention center, dummies. It's a brunch hop. It's at 15 different LA brunch locations. I should have known. Uh, okay, then I'll just go to all of those. Which one do I go to first? Who's to say? There's Baby's Breath Cafe, Bed Bugs, Rent Control, Dirty Laundry, Farmhouse Fresh, Shorts Accident. Ew. I would not eat someplace with a name like that. Farmhouse Fresh, I know, but it's actually pretty good. Sorry it took me so long to get here. How's it going? There's only a few minutes left of the contest. And so far? Not great. Nobody's taking my free kisses. Well, they're not exactly free if people have to do something to earn them. Plus, they're like, all melted. That's our snack. I was gonna kiss people. Time's up. Better get going anyway. I'm double parked. <sighs> no, this was my one shot ever forever. Okay, Rafe. You have to come clean with this girl, Sarah, all right? You gotta tell her why you can't go to the airport. You're gonna tell her why you can't go to LuxCon. You know, maybe she has a plus one. You think this is still about Sarah Dolores and how she bullied me so publicly once that I fell down a flight of bleachers and was in a medically induced coma for four weeks? And how when I got out of that coma and got back to school, everybody at school called me the sleeping homo. So now I have this toxic desire for approval of others and an obsession with fame? Well, that's ridiculous, Shayna. I've grown up. Mark! Sorry, we were just... Have you both forgotten what we're supposed to be doing here? This is supposed to be about me. You remember me? Rafe? Rafe! That sounds better. You know what? I'm sick of this. Every second of every day is Rafe, Rafe, Rafe. When we started doing this, I was doing a favor for my best friend, and you've done nothing but treat me like shit. Okay, Mark. No, I'm done with this bullshit. Your show, your problems, everything. It's some of the most selfish, most white, privilegious things I've ever seen. Okay, I don't know how you can accuse this show of being 
white privilege when you're on it and you're Filipino. I'm not even allowed in front of a camera and you silence me every time I try okay, to- Okay, I've heard enough. I quit! Well, that was something. You know what, Ray? Maybe you will be famous. Maybe one day you'll go down in history for being a dick. At least we still have Josh. So are you gonna be able to get through all that footage by yourself? Well, since I didn't win the contest and I didn't get into LuxCon, I really need to put all my efforts into this documentary web series. I think people will be compelled by my story and Mark's insane outburst. I mean, people really love to watch a crazy person unravel on screen. Okay, Rafe. I feel like this conversation's been a long time coming. I haven't wanted to face it, but I have to say, I don't think you're gonna be a famous social media influencer. Excuse me? I mean, we tried everything, you know? We built you the most perfect curated social media presence. You're a model on Instagram, you're a Twitter comedian, you're an activist on Facebook, but I think we need to face the reality that there just isn't anyone interested in this story. Your story. In college, I took a course that was called Discovering Your Potential. It was worth almost half a credit. And on the first day of class, the professor came in and she said, I'll never forget what she said. She said, knowing your dream is halfway to achieving it. I know my dream, Shayna. I know my dream. So, I've already done half the work for you. All I ever wanted was to become famous. Instantly. So I guess the only question I have left for you is, why is that so much to ask? I'll call you tomorrow. Good luck with the footage. Everybody's just jealous. How about we don't hear the camera person in this episode? What should I say, Mark? Oh, Mark knows how diet tea can ever my friend Mark, don't be nice to him or even look at him. You're a full idiot, Mark. It was Mark's job to wake me up. I'm gonna kill you, honestly, Mark. Yeah, we're trying to problem solve. Can you just focus on the camera, please? Mark! Mark! You know what, Mark? Fuck you and fuck your whole family, too. Hey, Mark, it's me, Rafe Blood. Um, I realize you're mad, so I don't blame you for not picking up. I just was watching some of the footage back and I realize I shouldn't have been so selfish and egotistical. I just, it comes really naturally to me since I'm so ambitious and focused on my goals. And anyway, um, I really screwed up big time, and uh, I feel terrible. So I just wanted to call, and Mark, I just wanted to say I'm so, so. Have you seen this? What? Hang up and get a buzz quiz right now. What? You are viral, like viral. What video is it? I don't know. Oh my God. Brett was supposed to this after he quit today. 
He was so mad. Uh, the influencer thing? Good God. He needs an IV. Alright, we can take my car. Actually, I blocked I can't you. Believe I that's... How many people have seen that? No, no, no. Don't, don't do that to yourself. How many? 12 million. Oh my God, my phone. Oh, the Ellen Show just emailed me. They want to bump Kristen Bell and put you on the show. Rafe, I'm so sorry. This wasn't how it was supposed to happen. It's so embarrassing. But you know what? Don't worry. I'll call Mark and tell him to take it down right now. No, no you can't call Mark. I don't know what I'll say. I know, but... It's just what he did. I know. I just can't conceive how anyone would do something like that. I know. How will I ever thank him? What? Shayna. I'm gonna be so fucking famous.